when a person is a chole, when a person becomes sick, that means whatever, parts of, whatever part of his body is missing light. Any part of your body where you're sick at a particular area is because that particular area of your body is missing light. Cholel means halal, missing. It's empty. It's empty of light. So we know, thank God, God did that. You know why? Because then how would you know what area you need to fix? If it's, a, if it's your stomach, if it's your head. It, God gave us specific areas that we're able to take that, oh, if it's a problem with my stomach, then something must be wrong with, my, with the way I eat. Something was wrong with the way I think. At the end of the day, God gave it to us so we're able to recognize exactly what area we need to fix. So, we have to understand, this is a spiritual problem. If you're trying to fix it without going into your spiritual, going into your soul state, you're really wasting your time. Of course, in the beginning, you do need medication. Of course you do need medication because you gotta get going. You gotta jump start the car. But once you get going, you have to realize that the source is really, it's a spiritual problem. Many times, a lot of addicts believe Again, it doesn't believe just drugs, food, anything. I'm just, I'm trucking across the board. Many times people say, once I get recovery, I'm, I'm, it's gone Aiden. Oh, no, 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 it's not gone Aiden. Now you have to deal with the issue that got you there. What got you there? How'd you, how'd you get here? I met a guy the other day, he's finally in recovery, and he's, he's okay, what's, where's my money? Where's the business? I'm recovering now. Why isn't the world turning around for me overnight? I said, that's what got you in there, is your impatience. Your impatience was the issue that got you in recovery, and if you don't realize it, now you have to realize that's the real source of the problem. That's what we have to deal with the ego. The ego is the cause of the pain, the soul is the cause of healing. Anytime we're going into our, 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 our ego state, that's where disaster comes in a person's life. And that's the biggest fight we have to fight, fight today. It's a, our life has always got, uh, that's why Azamra is so important, because it's, you're always going to focus on what's missing in your life. And if, you don't, if, you don't, if you're not careful with your focus in life, God knows where you can be. That's why depression is like the bite of the serpent. Nobody in the world attacked depression like Rabbi Nachman. Nobody attacked it like Rabbi Nachman. He had a hundred Torahs on depression. He had a hundred Torahs on habits. He had a hundred Torahs on, 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 on fixing the bread. Because he knew that's the problem in the generation. We could talk about butterflies and caterpillars all day, but that's not going to get you.